hello students welcome back to my channel in this video i am going to share energy level diagram of o2 molecule it is good example for homo nuclear diatomic molecule since it consists of only oxygen atoms so atomic number of oxygen atom is 8 so its electronic configuration so electronic configuration of oxygen atom is 1s2 2s2 2p4 total number of electrons present in o2 molecule is 16 so let us draw the energy level diagram for o2 molecule so the configuration of oxygen atom is 1s2 2s2 2p4 so initially we have to represent 1s2 atomic orbitals followed by 2s2 and 2p atomic orbitals so it is oxygen atom first oxygen atom and it is the second oxygen atom so here the configuration is 1s2 2s2 2p4 and for second oxygen atom also 1s2 2s2 2p4 we have to represent the orbital model and we have to fill with the electrons 1s2 so two electrons are present 2s2 two electrons are present coming to the 2p4 here we have to fill according to hund's principle so three degenerate orbitals are present so each one we have to fill with single electron then only we have to start pairing so it is the 2p4 configuration of one oxygen atom and similar is the configuration of second oxygen atom so during the formation of molecular orbitals the two atomic orbitals will combine and it results in the formation of two molecular orbitals when six atomic orbitals combine then it results in the formation of six molecular orbitals
here the molecular orbital should be filled according to hunds and of bose principle so the lowest energy levels should be filled here 1s2 orbital of first oxygen atom combines with 1s2 orbital of the second oxygen atom and results in the formation of sigma 1s2 and sigma star 1s2 so both the orbitals are filled with electrons and coming to the second energy level 2s2 orbitals combine and results in the formation of sigma 2s2 and sigma star 2s2 molecular orbitals that means each contains two electrons coming to the p atomic orbitals here four electrons are present on the other side also four electrons are present so initially we have to fill the molecular orbital with eight electrons so 2 3 4 5 6 these two are degenerated orbitals and these two are also degenerated orbitals so each one should be filled with single electron then only we have to pair up so it is called as sigma 2p x2 and these two are having same energy pi 2p y2 equal to pi 2p z2 and coming to these orbitals these are anti bonding orbitals and they can be known as pi star 2p y1 that is equal to pi star 2p z1 whereas sigma star 2p x is empty this is the molecular orbital diagram of o2 molecule here pi star 2p y and pi star 2p z consists of unpaired electrons so this o2 molecule is paramagnetic due to the presence of unpaired electrons so let us see the electronic configuration of o2 molecule along with the bond order and magnetic behavior coming to the electronic configuration of o2 molecule sigma 1s2 is having less energy than sigma star 1s2 which is having less energy than sigma 2s2 less than sigma star 2s2 less than sigma 2p x2 less than pi 2p y2 having equal energy that of pi 2p z2 less than pi star 2p y1 exactly equal to pi star 2p z1 it is the electronic configuration of o2 molecule and it is having less energy than sigma star 2p x coming to the bond order it can be calculated by using the formula half nb minus na that means the number of electrons present in bonding molecular orbitals minus number of electrons present in anti bonding molecular orbitals so that is equal to 10 minus 6 and that is equal to 2 so a double bond is present between the two oxygen atoms coming to the magnetic behavior o2 molecule is paramagnetic due to the presence of unpaired electrons 
If you like the video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.